today's problem from matrix and the problem is examine if the matrix A and B are congruent. Okay, here two given matrix are like A, this is given by and B is also given. And clearly these two matrices are real and symmetric because A transpose this is equal to also A and B transpose this is equal to also B. Right. Now here to prove A and B are congruent or not, we use an important theorem of matrix. The theorem is two real symmetric matrices of same order are congruent if and only they have the same rank and same signature. Okay, this is and same signature. What is signature? To find the signature of a matrix, we first find the number index. Index is the number of positive ones in the normal form of real symmetric matrix A. And generally index is denoted by M. Okay. And we also know what is the rank. Now we have to find if R in the rank we say. Now we have to find the value of 2M minus R. This is the signature of a matrix. Okay. So it is clear that we first have to find the normal form of A and B also. We start from A, here A to find the normal form. We make the operation, first operation is R2, 1, 1. This means the operation of second row with the help of first row. And the operation is we multiply with the row 1 is 1 and adding with 2. This operation means it is also written as R2 dash. This is equal to R2 plus R1. And another form we already write here. This is given by R211. Okay. Here this is also clearly write R2 plus 1 into R1. Okay. Now we get A becomes the first row is unchanged. This is 2 minus 1 0. And the second row is 0, this is minus 1, this is minus 2. Because minus 2 plus 2, this is 0. 1 plus minus 2, this is minus 1. Minus 2 plus 0, this is 0. Sorry, minus 2. And the third row is unchanged, this is 0, minus 2, 0. Okay. Now we use the column operation to get this element becomes 0. So we make the column operation as C21 1 okay and this is very simple operation and this operation gives 2 0 0 minus 1 0 minus 2 0 minus 2 0 this is unchanged now we make the operation as to get this element 0 so we make operation R3 2 this is 2. Sorry, this is minus 2. Okay. That is as R3 dash, this is equal to R3 minus 2 R2. Okay. So, we make this operation and get the matrix becomes the first row is unchanged 2, 0, 0. Second row also this, this is also unchanged. And the third row becomes this is 0, this is 0 and this is 4. Alright. Now we make the operation which is column operation. This is given by C3 2. This is minus 2. Okay. And clearly in similar manner we get 2 0 0. This is 0 minus 1 0. And this is 0 0 4. Right. Now we interchange. Now we interchange second and third row. Okay, and the operation can be written as R23. And this operation gives the matrix as 2, 0, 0, 0, 0, 
4 and 0 minus 1 0 okay now we get the relation or operation as this is c c 2 3 that is column 2 and column 3 in interchange this gives 2 0 0 this is 0 4 0 this is 0 0 minus 1 okay now we make two operation together the first operation is r1 half that is this this type of operation can be written r1 dash this is equal to half into r1 and also we get r2 1 by 4 okay so this relation gives or this operation gives 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 minus 1 okay clearly we get in the normal form of a 2 positive 1 this and this okay so index of this matrix or matrix a index index of a this is equal to m this is given by 2 and clearly there will be 3 non zero row and rank rank sorry rank is 3 so we get the signature signature of a signature signature is 2 a minus r and this is 2 into 2 minus 3 so 1 so we get the signature of the matrix a is equal to 1 and the rank of the matrix a this is equal to 3 now if the rank and signature of matrix B are also 3 and 1. Then by using this theorem, we say that A and B are congruence, otherwise not. Because this is an if and only if theorem. Now we have to find out the rank and signature of matrix B. Okay. To find out rank and signature of matrix B, we first make the operation which is given by R13. Okay, that is rank row 1 and row 3 be interchanged. And this operation gives this is 1, 4, 2, this is 4, 9, 4, this is 3, 4, 1. Right. Now we make the operation. The first operation is R2, 1, minus 4, and R3, 1, minus 3. And these two operation together gives. The first row unchanged 1, 4, 2 and the second row this element B0, this element is 9 minus 16 that is minus 7. This element is 4 minus 8 so this is minus 4. This is 0 and this is 4 minus 4 into 3 that is 12 so minus 8 and this is 1 minus 6. This is given by minus 5. Okay. Now we make another operation which is given by R3, 2. This is minus 1. Okay. And we get the matrix become 1, 4, 2. This is given by 0, minus 7, minus 4. And this is 0. This is also given by this is minus 1 this is minus 1 right now we make two operation together these are column operation the first column operation is c21 minus 4 and c31 minus 4 this is a simple operation this is 1 0 0 this is 0 minus 7 minus 1 this is 0 minus 4 minus 1 right now we make another operation this is sorry r 2 3 that is row 2 and row 3 interchange and this operation gives the matrix becomes 1 0 0 first row is unchanged second row becomes 0 minus 1 minus 1 and third row is 0 minus 7 minus 4 okay now we make the operation row 3 2 this is minus 7 and this operation gives 1 0 0 this is 0 minus 1 minus 1 and this is becomes 0 0 
and this is given by this is minus 4 plus 7 so this is 3 right and we get or we make another operation this is column operation c3 to minus 1 and this gives 1 0 0 0 minus 1 0 0 0 3 okay and now we get r 3 1 third. so we get this is 1 0 0 0 minus 1 0 0 0 1 right now again we interchange second and third row that is r 2 3 this gives 1 0 0 0 0 1 and 0 minus 1 0 now we interchange c 2 3 and this gives 1 0 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 minus 1 okay and this is the normal form of b clearly the normal form of b and normal form of a here the normal form of a are the same so here we say that from two normal form these two matrix are must congruence okay and if we find out the rank rank of b this is equal to 3 because it has 3 non zero row and index index this is equal to 2 because it has 2 1 positive ones so we get signature signature of b this is equal to 2a minus r so it is obviously 4 minus 3 this is 1 so we get rank of b is 3 here rank of a is also 3 here signature of b is 1 here signature of b also 1 so these two matrix that is matrix a and matrix b must be congruence okay very very important problem of matrix thank you thank you for watching